Hey guys, we got an update here from the uh, story about uh, Joker and Harley Quinn. I um, mean that I said uh, I did a video about that about Joker and Harley Quinn and updates on them from Forbes, and uh, they talk about how Harley Quinn is not expected to reprise her role uh, in the Suicide Squad, the one that's going to be directed by James Gunn. But here they have an update here. They literally just add update we have learned from sources close to the production that in fact the information about Harley Quinn being absent from the new Suicide Squad movie is no longer up to date. She is indeed expected to appear in the James Gunn Suicide Squad, which is expected to be gun production later this year. So I think this is going to be really interesting, and I'm glad that she's going to be a part of this. And it just seems to make to make more sense that she's going to be a part of this, and she was just a fan favorite from there. It really hit. Uh, this is really the movie that kind of started um, uh, Margot Robbie's fame and stuff. Obviously, she hit the map with um, with the, the 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 movie there with the uh, with the uh, the Scorsese movie and stuff that she did and stuff. That was really interesting there. Uh, I think that was really, really, it really was a good movie and stuff. But here's, I think the Suicide Squad movie is definitely going to be one of her her main roles she's known for. Um, and I think that's really going to be interesting to see as to where things go and how James Gunn is able to play with the character because I think that's definitely a character he'd want to play with. I think he's definitely one of those characters I'd love to see him play with, and I can't wait to see as to how he uses this. So let me know what you think, guys, about this in the comments below. What are you excited to see her in the Suicide Squad uh, sequel? Um, they're saying it's a sequel, but they're also saying that it's also kind of a, a relaunch of the uh, uh, of the movie. So I think that'd be interesting to see. I mean, obviously it's connected since they're using the same. Margot Robbie expected to, re to come back and play Harley Quinn. I think this is going to be interesting to see as to how much she's actually in the movie because she's currently filming um, Birds of Prey right now. So if she fin finishes that and then they decide to start filming that right away, I'm not sure if she'd want to, she's going to do like an uh, Avengers thing where they just kind of, she films one movie and jump stops, go right into the next movie and just completely a whole year filming as the same character. That could be kind of interesting. I'd love to see that if that works out that way. Um, but if they start to, if they, they, if they end up starting filming before they're even done Birds of Prey, then she might have less uh, time in that. So I think it's going to be interesting to see as to where things start, as to when this movie, uh, Birds of Prey, ends filming and when does the next one film. Obviously, she's not in every scene in Birds of Prey and stuff, but I mean, she's going to be a lot of that. So it'll be interesting to see as to how much she'll be in there if she's filming both at the same time. That could be quite interesting. Or if they just wait for her to be done to have her entirely in the next movie. Uh, so she, since she was such a more popular character, one of the most popular characters from the Suicide Squad and a very got star from that uh, from that movie, I think it's definitely going to be interesting to see as to where things go with that. So let me know what you think about this in the comments below. What do you think James Gunn is going to do with the character and how do you want him to, to do a thing? And I think you need to see happen. Uh, it's also not confirmed. We also still have anything said to whether or not Jared Leto's Joker is in there, but it seems like he's pretty much done with the role and he's no, not going to be in there either. So we'll have to wait and see as to where things go with this, but let me know what you think guys about this in the comments below and uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out. I'm Captain America, here to talk to you about one of the most valuable traits a soldier or student can have. Subscribing. Sometimes subscribing. is the key to victory. Sometimes it leads to very little, and it seems like it's not worth it. And you wonder why you waited so long for something so disappointing. How many more of these? You're still here. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, guys. Peace. It's over.